Welcome to this demo video of Flixster's Next. Now this is going to be your go-to platform to do your video streaming, to do your podcasting and your blogging. So when you get to uh, Flixster's and you want to set up your channel, just you, you put in your channel name. In this case, I'm putting in Lifestyle, uh, which is the uh, subdomain name that Flixster's is going to create. Then you put your email in there and then you complete setup and then you get this text, which allows you to go to your a created site uh, with your credentials that you can see here. So I've done that here. I just log in and you get to the screen. Uh, you put your credentials in and then you log in and then you can see this icon here. Now you can change obviously your uh, profile pic uh, down here. Just go to settings and you fill in your username and all the details that you normally would uh, put uh, as your profile right if you want to log out just press this button and you're logged out what i've also uh, opened up is the admin panel so i've uh, if you click on this admin panel you'll get to this menu where you get all your setting details now you will have to if you want to use youtube um, to import videos uh, based on channel or based on a, a search term then uh, you do have to put in your general settings which is your youtube api so let me just put an api in there we go back to our channel obviously there are no videos there are no blogs there are no podcasts uh, we're just gonna fill the the channel with those videos and with podcasts and with blogs so you can see why this is your go-to platform for all three okay so let's go back to the admin panel and let's load some videos uh, you can use your own channel or you can use just a search term so i'm just going to import from youtube and in this case i can say you know i've got a lifestyle channel so i'll put lifestyle in here you can choose your category where you import your channels and a username. I'm just not going to do that at the moment. And here it goes. So you can see all kind of lifestyle videos in here, uh, which are already pre-selected for you, right? So, you know, there are tons of lifestyle uh, videos. If I go all the way down, it loads like 50 videos. If you want to have more, just load more and you'll have uh, 50 uh, lifestyle videos more now if you do not want to uh, import a certain video uh, for example i don't want to import this video uh, you just see deselect it so let me just import those videos and there we go we're already done so let's go back to the channel so when i refresh the screen you will see that those videos are going to be loaded and there we are. So these are all the lifestyle videos that we've chosen. We can do that from a search term, but you can also choose a channel, right? So a lifestyle challenge, uh, channel that you like. So you can just choose a video and let me just stop it there. And then you can go to the channel of that video and you just pick the channel just stop that there and then copy the channel name go to your admin panel choose import from channel put your channel id in here and search and you can see all these uh, videos here you can obviously load more than 50 but you can just import it and once you've imported then you can go back to your channel and reload and then you'll see that these videos have been imported the other thing that you can do is single video import you just uh, select cloud import here and you can import a single video from youtube vimeo tiktok mp4 link facebook uh, google drive and dropbox so let me show you how this works so when i go to dropbox uh, i just you know select a video in this case, I've selected this video and I just copied the URL and I'll put it in here. So it'll fetch the video. So what you want to do is for each imported video, you want to do a thumbnail. Um, I'll just select one and then you put a, vi a video title in a description. 
you choose your category, uh, you can do geo-blocking if you want, visible to anyone in all the ages, and put in a tag, right? And this video duration is... Hey guys, welcome! 2153. 2153. There we go, we publish it. And your video is published, right? So, you can do the same thing with Google Drive. Uh, it goes a little bit different. Um, when you select your video on Google Drive, you click on these three uh, buttons there and then you choose embed. And then on the embed code, you just select the embed code and then you go here and you can import the video and the rest works the same. So on Facebook, you do the same. You can go to your videos, videos for you. You select the uh, video here. You go to the three dots on this side and you choose embed. You copy the code for this video and you do the same thing here. Paste it and you fetch the video. And the rest works the same. Okay, so now we've imported the videos. Let's import a podcast. So once you're in the podcast uh, screen, you just create a new podcast. You put in your title and you put in your description. Now this needs to be 20 words uh, of length. So once you put in your description, you select your audio file. Uh, an mp3 uh, extension is the audio file. You can see you, we uh, support mp3 and OGG. And then you upload a thumbnail. Okay, you put in your tag and you choose publish. Once you choose publish, you can see here the green line that's going to go to 100% and then you'll see the podcast is published. And we can see that the podcast has been successfully posted and here's your podcast. So there's where you can play it. All right. Welcome to the product launch podcast. And people can do that from any device. Okay, now we've done the podcast, let's go to uh, the blog posts and let's create a blog post here and you'll see that you'll go to the admin panel to do your blog post. Let's do a blog post here, let me move that mic. Um, so why you should get Flixters um, and we'll put in a description and we'll put in a text. Just for simplicity's sake, I obviously just copy paste the text right here. You can do the editing uh, the way you like. If you wanna put something bold, you can do that. Um, you can put links in here uh, and so on. So we'll select an image. Uh, you choose your category and your tags, and then you do publish. And you can see your new article has been published. You can see it here. Um, and if you go to blog post, you'll see a summary here with all other blog posts. It's that simple. Okay, now we've done our um, blog post, our podcast and our videos. We obviously want to have an introduction video. So. When we want to have an introduction video on our homepage, then we'll just go to the admin panel and we go to intro video. Now in the intro video, you set your intro video, you have to select videos that are already imported. Okay, so let's do that right now. We'll just cloud import a video of Flixsters. This is the YouTube URL. We'll just paste it in there. We'll fetch the video and that's all okay. So we'll publish that. And this is the video title. So let's refresh this and let's select this video. 
Okay, that's done. And then when we land on this again, and you'll see that here the intro video is there. And obviously there is where you want to introduce your channel. Uh, you want to show that you've got your blog post there in your podcast and how they can consume your content. Okay, so I showed you how you can import your own videos and other people's videos. Now, when you choose to uh, import other people's videos, um, and you're obviously logged in, you can edit the video and put in your own descriptions, your own title. This is what we call our ethical video hacking. So if you wanna promote uh, Flixers, for example, you can just put in your affiliate link here, get people to the page and earn yourself a nice commission. Okay, if you wanna change the thumbnail that you can see here, just click here and then get your thumbnail that you wanna have on your channel. So the great thing about Flixsters is that any podcast, blog post or video you can share on social media. So you can choose Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn and Pinterest, or you can just select this uh, link here, just copy it and then, you know, uh, use that wherever you'd like. So another great feature of Flixsters is that people can subscribe to your channel, right? So at this moment I'm in here as Kimberly and if I go to my admin panel and go to users manage users you can actually see the users on here now you will not get this on YouTube guys uh, you will not get emails okay so this is a important uh, asset that you can achieve with Flixus channels so what do people need to do if I just log out and I'm in here as a visitor, so I can uh, look at a video. Uh, uh, but whenever I wanna do a like, I either need to log in or sign up. So you push people to sign up. So obviously with your intro video, you will ask them to sign up, right? And you'll show them where to do that. In this way, you can easily grow your list with Flixsters. And then the last thing I wanna show you today is that people can just select a dark mode or a light mode, whatever they please, uh, when they come to your channel. And this concludes this demo.